KDC, I'm Emily. And I'm Madeline. And here are your current events for Wednesday, January 7th. Attention seniors, just a reminder, if you have not placed your order for your graduation cap and gown, you must do so by Friday to avoid late fees. Orders must be submitted online to jossens.com. For more information, see Ms. Knight and Student Services. Attention seniors, there will be someone at DCHS to help seniors and their families complete, this, complete and submit FOSFA on Monday, January 12th from 3 to 6 p.m. It is very important that, it, that any senior interested in attending college complete the FOSFA. This is a great opportunity for you to get some help with this difficult form. Please sign up in Ms. Campbell or Ms. Kimbrell in the guidance office if you are interested. There will be limited opportunities. From Coach Hurley, starting Wednesday, January 7th, we will have general admission tickets on sale for Friday's boys and girls basketball game at Apollo. Tickets will be sold out at the sold out of the athletic office each day from noon until 3:30. Adult tickets are five and students are two. See Coach Hurley for more information. From Mr. Norris, attention all of Mr. Norris's art students from last semester. Please pick up your artwork by Friday, by this Friday, January 9th, or it will be given or thrown away. Now stay tuned for a short message from Mr. Flew. DC, uh, back in November, we had a safety audit uh, team come in and conduct a safety audit. Uh, this team met with parents and uh, students, especially a lot of students and uh, teachers. One concern that the teachers uh, brought up, and especially the students, a whole lot of students brought up, was dress code, the enforcement of dress code. So I just want to touch base today with those students, make sure everybody's on the same page. And this mainly has to deal with girls, girls' fashion. I'm not in the girls' fashion, so sorry. Legging jeggings, yoga pants, whatever those pants are called, just make sure the top garment is long enough that you wear on top. You can wear the leggings, you can wear the yoga pants, the jeggings, you can wear those, just make sure the top garment is long enough. If not, then you will be sent down here to see me or Mr. Powers and you have a chance to lose that exam exemption. We do not want that to happen, so make sure your top garment is long enough. And uh, teachers have been instructed to look for this. It doesn't matter if it's first period, second period, third period, or fourth period. They've been instructed to look for this. And if you're out of dress code, then you will be sent down here. So make sure the top garment is long enough. Thank you for your time. From Coach Brandon, intramural basketball, intramural boys basketball signups will be all this week. You must have a roster and fees will must be paid by this Friday. Games this year will be played on Sundays from 3 to 6. The fee is $50 per team. You, any questions, see Coach Brandon. From Ms. Gilbert, there will be a CEC meeting on Friday, January 9th at 7.30 a.m. in room 167. All peer tutors and CEC members should attend. Any questions, see Ms. Gilbert in room 167. The DCHS Health and Fitness Club is coming January in January 2015. Are you interested in a healthy lifestyle? Do you plan to have a career in health or fitness? Teacher fitness instructions, coach, diet, dietitian, nurse, doctor, or trainer. This club may just this club may be just for you. Email just email or stop by or see Coach Brandon in room 111 or Nurse Birch in the nurse's office. From Miss Smith, the Key Club will meet this Friday, January 9th at 7:45 a.m. in room 238. Reminder from, from Ms. Powers, don't let the February ACT deadline pass you by. The deadline is January 9th. To avoid paying late fees for February 7th ACT date, J juniors, this is a great opportunity to get familiar with the ACT test before you take the state ACT test in test date in March. See Ms. Powers and guidance for more information. All DCHS students are invited to attend any or all of the following ACT prep sessions. Sessions take place in the CCR room and begin at 3.20 and end at 4.25. These prep sessions will give an overview of the ACT, share test taking tips, and will provide study materials. Please see Ms. Colbert in the CCR room for more information. The next session will be Wednesday, January 21st. Here's what's going on today at DC. At DC. The Panthers and Lady Panthers JV teams are traveling to take on Apollo starting at 6 p.m. That's all your news for today, DC. Have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Stay phenomenal, DC. I pulled up to the house about seven or eight, and I yelled to the cabbie, "Yo, home, smell you later." Looked at my kingdom, I was finally.